Good morning, campers. Guess where we are? Yosemite West Mariposa KOA. We're west of Yosemite National Park, which is where we're heading this morning, but we're east of the town of Mariposa by about seven miles. We're in a little bitty town called Mid Pines, California, on Highway 140. Let me take you on a tour through the campground. Let's take a look at what it looks like. This seems to be a really nice campground, but hey, it's a KOA. They got here. They got their own bus stop here. The bus going well, like it says, it goes to Yosemite National Park. What's it say? Yarts. Yosemite Area Rapid Transit Service, I would guess. Huh, isn't that nice? All right, let's take a look. On the right looks familiar. Got a little bathroom here on the left. Right there, 30 amp sights. 50 on the left. It's September, so everything's pretty dry back through here. Look what they got on the hill there. Nothing like solar. And also, they got a nice playground there for the little snots. Here's the office on the left, and there's a store. This one has two stores. Not only do they have your regular store with the uh, cans of beans and bread and camping equipment, what have you, they have another store is a store where they shall sell t-shirts and sweatshirts and whatnot. <clears throat> KOA always has cabins and these don't look terribly old by just looking at the exterior logs because these are weather as the years go by and they'll lose, lose that nice brown color. These folks got a little tent site set up. This is a pretty hilly campground, so they've had to level everything. And then down here, I think you call that a yurt. Now notice, if you will, that's a three bedroom tent. That's a big ass tent. And then I think this is about us. You know, come around. Oh yeah, another one more cabin. Notice the cabin parking sign. There's a swoon pool straight ahead at the bottom of the hill. Nice treesy campground, that's for sure. He's got lounging areas around the pool. Please, no pets in the pool. Yes, I imagine that would be true. Got a couple bears there guarding the front end. They sell propane right here. And I don't know whose house this is.
Now this appears to be an older cabin by the color of the wood, but notice the ramp. It's a handicapped cabin. And I don't know if that was required by the state. cabins up on the hill. Everything's in nice repair. Nice and clean. As is usually you find at a KOA. I suspect that's the owner's house back there in his big barn with his big RV in it. <laughs> I, I would suspect. I'm pretty sure it's not the uh, It's not the seasonal employee's place. It's nice if your business already has a property. Sure, just put, put your house, sell some house up on it and live there. See, even the garbage cans had nice little... Yeah. See, the picnic tables aren't too bad. I haven't seen any graffiti around here, so... Better class of kids are brought up here, I guess. It's like they they dropped a couple of trees there and cut them up into sections. I don't know if they're just gonna let them sit, sit and lay. There's more work to be done. Notice the game trail. Not only is some, some game using that trail, it's using it regularly enough to make it nice and dirt. Here's your pet run area. It's the only place they'll let you let your pet off leash. There's a dump station right here. Here's the bathroom. It is men and women. Oh, kind of small. Very nice. The fixtures and everything is a nice repair. Got a fan. To take care of that. Even got a rug on the floor. All right, camper, so here's the brochure for this place. And here's our map. Gives you an idea how the campground's laid out. And uh, from the map, I can tell you the, the features that they have. You, you saw the dog, dog run. And right across the road from the dog run is the dump station. Now these sites on the map you see in red are electricity and water only. They don't have a dump station. But the yellow ones, you see, they, they do have dump station. They also have cable TV. And uh, you saw this with the swimming pool. Here's, here's the pet walk. And over here is a walking trail. And there was a, they, oh, they got a caboose and a video arcade that says there's phones here at the office and then next, next to the pool. There's a camper sink on the back side of the office building and another restroom with showers there. Uh, uh, water there. Oh, playground down here. And uh, more water at this end. That's where those yurts were we, we looked at that three room tent. And uh, some of these cabins are deluxe cabins. Oh, right here. These are the deluxe cabins, only two of those. Those are pretty good size places. 
pretty nice KOA, as most of them are. Uh, you know, KOA has uh, mystery campers, and uh, if that's a paying job, I wouldn't mind having that. But uh, they come in and they pay their fee and they, they spend the night or two. And I, I don't know if they even talk to the people. Um, uh, I've uh, learned a little bit about mystery shoppers for stores and things in town. And uh, sometimes, you know, uh, they, they make the purchase, go out to their car and come back and with a clipboard and a report. But uh, other places, they're mystery shoppers, mystery campers. They don't, they don't say anything. They just act like a customer. And uh, I can't remember how KOA does theirs. And they just leave and make their report and submit it to the office. And, uh, but I don't know if they get paid to do that or not. Uh, some places, uh, you know, they'll, they'll, KOA may pay for the camping. I, I don't know. I, I can't remember. I read about it years ago, but uh, their website would tell you all about that. But uh, still, if there was a paying job, I wouldn't mind having it. And they even got these cute little trash can enclosures. I suppose that's to confuse the bears. So I wanted to show you the, the picnic tables they offer. Every site seemed to have the same one, metal frame and wood. And uh, no graffiti, so. And just this little barbecue here. Has a nice rack for barbecuing, but uh, this park does not allow any wood fires. And uh, we was up in Yosemite and we noticed that Yosemite does allow, they do have campfire pits, so they do allow it up there, so it's not a, a state or forest thing, so it's just a KOA thing, or just this particular KOA thing, no fires.